Hello friends, welcome. So in the previous video, we worked with the uh, tags. We can add tags and when we delete the post, we also detach the tags automatically. So in this video, I'm going to add a link here because right now we just create the tags with uh, from the Tinker. I'm going to add the link here to go to the tags, the same we have for the post and go and make a CRUD for the tags, okay? So first we need to create the controller. So I'm going to, in the terminal, and I'm going to say php artisan make controller, and I'm going to say tag controller. Hit enter. Okay. Now let's go in the VS code. Go to the roads web road. And here we have the road resource for posts. Let's copy this and do the same thing for the tags. And here we need to add the tag controller. So tag controller. Make sure you import the tag controller here and let's save it. Now we need to go inside the resources, uh, views and layout. In the navigation, we need to add the link, the same we have for the post. So let's copy this and duplicate it. Change the road to be tags, the same thing here. And also, let's say tags here. Save it. If I come here and refresh, we have the tags. And if we click right now, the tag controller index method is does not exist. So let's go and create that. App HTTP controllers tag controller and here, let's create the index method. And here we need to display all the tags. So I'm going to say dollar sign tags and call the tag model. Okay, import that and all static method. And let's return the view. We don't have that view yet. We need to create, so I'm going to say tags.index and here add the tags. So compact tags. Save it. So we get all the tags here and we return the view tags index. Here we need to create that blade and also we add the tags in this, inject the tags in this view. So now let's go and create the index blade inside the tags folder. Okay, so inside the resources, views, I'm going to create a new folder, name it tags, and here a new file index.blade.php. Okay, and I'm going to copy what we have in the posts index. So let's select all here, copy and paste it in the tax index. Just say here all tags. The road is going to be tax create to create a new tag, and also we need to say here a new tag. Okay. Now for tag, we need only the ID and the name. We don't have the image, so let's remove this for the image. Also here we need the name, but now instead of saying for each post, we need to say for each tags as a tag. Okay and add the tag ID and the tag name. 
So let's select double tag ID and tag name. Remove this for the image. And now here we need to say tags edit. And we need to add the tag ID. Okay, and the same thing for the destroy. So tags destroy and add the tag ID. Okay, let's save it and let's see what we have. If I refresh, okay, new tag. Don't, we don't have any tags right now. So let's click here. And right now we don't have this method. So let's go and create that in the, I'm going to close this in the tag controller. Now let's create the create method. So function create. And here we need to return the view tags create. Just that, save it. And now we need to go inside the resources, uh, tags, and here create a new blade. And we need to name it create.blade.php. Okay, and I'm going to copy the same thing in the we have in the post. So let's select all copy and paste it here. And we need to make some changes. First, create new tag. After we need to go the route in the tags store. Okay, we don't need images here, so let's remove this from the form. Next, here we need the name. And also here we need to say name and the name is going to be name here. The next one, name in the error. And that's it. We don't need image. And we don't need also the body so let's remove all of that and also we don't need tags because we are going to create tags and that's it we have only the name here for the tags let's save it let's come here and refresh and yeah here it is now we need because we say tag roads road tags store but in the controller, we don't have that method for store, so let's create that. So, function store, and here we need the request dollar sign request. Okay, And I'm not going to create a new request for the this one because we have only the name. So I'm going to validate here. Call this sign request validate. And I'm going to say the name is going to be required. And that's it. Next one, we need to say uh post create and add the name to be dollar sign request name and after that we need to return and i'm going to open the post controller so here we have i'm going to Copy this with status here and paste that in. Now we need to return not in the boss index, but in the tags index. That was going to be the tag created successfully. Let's save it and let's see now what we have here. So let's say first 
tag, create the tag, oh, we need to add the title. Why we have, if we go in the tags, we have a name. Okay, my mistake, I add post here, but we need to say tag. Okay, and let's go back, refresh again, first tag, and now the tag created successfully. Create new one, second. Okay, and yeah, the tag created successfully and we have here. Now let's work with edit and delete. So we delete, we have already created so in the index we added this uh, method tags destroy so we need to create only the method there but for the edit let me copy this method here and go down there just to save some time i'm going to change this to be edit and here now we need the tag dollar sign tag and return views tags edit and here we need to add that tag so compact tag here let's save it and let's go in the resources tags and i'm going to save this create as edit so let's save this as a edit blade.php. Okay, now the value is going to be old name, and because we are in the edit, we have the tag here, and I'm going to say tag name here, and the method is going to be post. We need to override here to say method to be put and now the road is going to be tags update and we need to add here the tag id that's it let's save it and if i refresh let's click at this edit and we are in the tags one let's go to the tags and let's select this one now tags to edit okay let's change this to be update so in the edit let's say update here and update tag here okay and now let's work with controller after the edit we need to create a new controller a new method sorry new method for update and here we need the request dollar sign request and also we need the tag dollar sign tag okay and let's uh, validate the name first let's copy this paste down there after that, I'm going to say assign tag, call the update method, update and say name is going to be with the request name. Okay, and now let's return to the index and I'm going to say the tag updated save go back refresh let's update the second tag update the tag updated and we have second tag updated let's update the first tag okay let's go again and if i remove all and say update we have the name field is required very good now let's work with delete. So 
So let's come in the controller and let's say function. And here we need to say destroy. Add the tag dollar sign tag. And let's say dollar sign tag delete that's it and let's return to the tax index uh, we need to not return to the road but return uh, return back save because we are here so we just delete confirm this and we return back so if i say delete here click ok the tag updated we need to change this to say deleted and that's it from here refresh and now we have created the crowd for tags so we can create update and delete tags okay friends hope you enjoy and see you in the next video friends all the best